Hi, Carol here and welcome to my craft room. I'm really sorry I've been MIA lately. I've just been really busy trying to uh, work part-time, keep the house up, organize. I'm actually really getting into this organizing this craft room. I am going to, uh, when I get back, it's going to be totally um, card craft making on the go stuff. Um, I'm tired of ordering. I think I have just about everything I need. <laughs> and um, so anyway, my I wanted to show you a few things. One is the Copic Air System. I'm really pumped up about this uh, Copic class that I joined. Uh, it's getting better every day, learning so many awesome techniques. And uh, I just wanted to show you if you're interested in airbrushing and systems, at Michael's you get 40% off if you look for these and the, they're really reasonable. So I started out with this little kit when I first started coloring last year. And I've bought a couple of these for friends and um, that because when they go on sale and then you use your 40% you get a really good buy on this unit. So uh, I keep that one as a spare. And then there's the 180 pound can here, pressurized can. I have this spare one. I already used up a can and this is another can I'm into. And uh, it comes with the Copic gun to put your marker in. And this is a beautiful unit. It has a nice um, hookup system so that you just go from the can to your uh, gun here. I have mine hooked up to my new compressor. And uh, you're set to go. So this will be really good for traveling to bring with you or the other one but uh, I like this one because it gives you a lot of room to move around and has a lot of air so there's that one you can get at Michael's um, that system and then Ellen Hudson like I said had that sale on she probably still does 20% uh, off of an air compressor presser. and this air compressor is awesome Plus, if you join the Copic class, you get another 15% off by using the code. So I went ahead and used that because I did want to have a compressor. This is the most lightweight compressor I have seen up to date. And look at this. Isn't this cool? So you just plug it in. I have it all set up. And it is only 7 pounds. It sits right on a tiny table I have because I don't like putting stuff on the floor. Uh, if I can help it and so it just it's right beside me and then it has this huge hose this beautiful um, cloth type hose look how many feet I mean I could probably go downstairs and be using it <laughs> look at it all so it just hangs there and the reason I like it not because it's so lightweight that's a bonus but it's quiet and it is moisture it takes the moisture out of uh, uh, most compressors they get wet in the system in the line and then your marker gets damp and sprays out so uh, this is just an awesome deal I think it was like with shipping in that uh, it was 234 plus my shipping was probably was around 275 dollars I paid with the shipping to Canada that's really good like that's a good buy I'm just lifting it up and putting it over here. And um, and then get rid of the cord there. And it's right by my side when I want to start using my Copics. And that's awesome. So I got my Copic bag and it's ready to travel. And I'm really excited about this. I'm just hoping that the weight-wise, it's a tad heavy. But... Um, so I'm prepared to go and I'll show you what I put in here. I think I have it on here backwards probably, yes. There we go. So what I put in here is are <laughs> um, some images. But I have bags of images that I have prepared. I think they're in here. Yes. So I just put little baggies. And I have, these are all girl images here. And 
so are these and these are all flower images and I just did this one last night uh, practicing and I used some Wink Estella. I don't know if you can see that inside there um, and I'm really enjoying that so I have that and then I have a bag full of empty um, just blank cardstock now I bought that uh, I went back and I got tons of that 120 pound recollection cardstock because today is the last day yesterday and today you had 25% off your total order plus you could use your 40% coupon so it was awesome I got a lot of st uh, good deals and um, so for traveling I got it fit all my markers and then I needed uh, it only came with one two three four five six two, four, six of the mesh bags. So I had to get something else because there was leftovers there, right? So this little bag is on sale at Michael's and it has all little units on the side, but I didn't need that. And these flaps just lie flat and I'm able to get like all of my, these are the flat, the large markers that I use most frequently. So I put them back there and I was able to put my memento there, um, a small um, um, see my mind's gone blank um, to put your image on, to put your stamp on acrylic block, there you go, and then I put just one because I'm traveling with this, I put one Wink of Stella in here, I put my Copic uh, markers, my multi-liners the ones I use the most are 0 0.03, 5, and 1. Then I put my white markers. Oh, and I put my 7 in there too. So four of them. I brought with me four out of eight. Then two of my white pens. Uh, which ones are these? I'm not sure there. Uni Uniball? Anyway, I like these ones. And then I brought a water brush because I'm going to bring, actually I bought, brought five water brushes. There's my water brushes at the back there, see them? Because I'm going to use some of my, um, I brought my Tim Holtz uh, color pens, my distress pens. And then, so that flattens out. Then I have my practice uh, images in here like this. And then before, because, um, you have an hour, an hour and a half to wait. So instead of just playing around on my iPad, I'm going to practice my Copics. And then I brought uh, these Copic um, sketch quads that will help me um, just to have some ideas of the color families. But I've been working outside of the color families. I have always done that. I've never stuck with just whatever looks good I go with. And then remember I had put all these hair uh, combinations uh, and I just um, used my um, plastic thing up there and I put I coated them and that'll come back to me too oh my I must be tired and then I have my Copic books that have I'm gonna bring my laptop and these have the CDs in them and um, I'm gonna go up and have some of the uh, images run off so that I can practice with these as well. So I put those in there and then just some larger images that I wanted to do. I uh, hope you can see that. Uh, practice so I slid them in there and this is what's going to the airport with me. Right there. And I'm going to have fun just sitting there and coloring. Put this right beside me. I was, I was, Sandy Elnock said she doesn't have any problems flying with her markers. Uh, so hopefully I won't have any problems. It would be a terrible thing to have them confiscated, wouldn't it, the airport? But uh, I'm going to call there actually probably this afternoon and make sure everything is good. The measurements are good. I think you can have up to 22 pounds. So I got that all ready to go. And then I bought these, um, oh, I forgot to put that in my Copic book, but I have all the Copics. 
Uh, so um, that's why I took it out. I didn't think I really needed it. So I'll just put it back in my Copic. That's where I keep my Copics over there. But I, they had these uh, little photo cases on sale. And I'm telling you, um, I bought a lot of them. I bought them for my husband and I have the Fitbit. And I put all of our stuff separate in one of these and put them away so that I know who's, what stuff is his, what stuff is mine. You know, and he bought me all the colored wristbands and... Um, so I like to keep them where I can see through and then I just used a marker permanent marker and I put you know both our names on each case and it's easy to grab and when I need to um, charge it or anything or I need to see results on the computer of his or mine it's all in our own cases and these were really really reasonable I think I ended up paying a dollar 25 a piece after maybe less than that maybe a dollar each and then I bought all these new brushes. I am addicted to paint brushes, especially using them with uh, Distress inks. So I bought a new flat one and I bought some calligraphy because I'm going to bring my calligraphy inks here, my Speedball pigment inks, and I'm going to practice doing some calligraphy. And I bought the long uh, brush I hope you can see it here. Does this help if I put it up against there? There we are. I bought the long one and I bought the semi one. And let me see. And then I just, all the ones I thought that I would need, they, they had such good buys at Michael's. Uh, this one's a really nice one really firm um, this is the number four round and um, oh. sorry I was just cleaning out some stuff in my nails yuck um, look at this one isn't that a beautiful edge really nice so I got all these brushes yesterday and look at this nice one for getting into um, the nooks and crannies is just really tiny so I'm gonna have enough brushes here and they fit in this case wonderfully then I bought um, let me see yeah so because it, they all didn't have lids on them this box was perfect so I think I got 10 of these boxes and um, I wanted to show you, this is a wonderful, I, I am just overwhelmed at the fact that this heavyweight paper, it's $20 and if you use your 40% coupon and then you're 25% off everything, um, I stocked up, I, I don't have to buy paper for the rest of my lifetime, <laughs> yeah, and um, I got, the, um, so I think, let me see, there's 100 sheets, so I think I have 500 of each color. And I got the beige, the white, uh, five packages, and then the black because you cannot, these would make beautiful card bases for doing so many techniques uh, with. So um, I got that. And then um, I keep my markers in this Stampin' Up! case that I, I got uh, something in. But uh, my Wink Estellas are in that case that I got at Michael's. So that's a, you know, for traveling. This is really nice. Uh, so I got that. And um, remember I said I want to get another brayer? Well, they were on sale. 30% 30, 30 off all of Martha Stewart stuff plus the 25%. So you're getting 55% off anything Martha Stewart. So I everything that I wanted as far as that. And this has a little stand so it keeps it off the, you know, surface. So that was nice. And I just, and I bought those big units for the back of my door, which I absolutely love. I'm just going to get this out. They just really organize everything so well. I wanted to get one of these uh, hot... Um, tools, the heating tools, because, oh, um, I wanted the, the
the real tiny one with the point on it. I'm going to show you some wonderful techniques. And for using crayons and chalks with this flat iron, it's absolutely amazing. And this is beautiful set. And, you know, 30%, I got 55% off of it. I've already got it put away. So um, that was nice. in my hanging door unit which I absolutely love can't say enough about them they're beautiful just close them up and sheer organization I put it over on my blog stampinribbons.blogspot.com if you want to see it and then um, what else did I pick up here I got a few new stencils. So I got these little flying things here. These little bugs, these flying whatever you call them. Uh, I like that stencil. I've been eyeballing that for a while. And then I absolutely love this folk art one. It has the hummingbird. Um, I think, is that a crow, an owl, and a pheasant? They're just beautiful. So anyway, um, got that because of the sale and then I picked up I'm just storing my stuff so I'm getting everything organized here to get put in my apothecary finally and then I bought a couple of these um, ranger papers with the gloss finish to travel with so I'm going to put that in there because that's good with your uh, alcohol inks and then Heidi Swap had these, they're so cute, these words here. So I got one of those. These weren't on sale, but I got 25% off. With all my heart, with the heart stencil. Cute. And let me see here. Then I wanted to get some uh, masking tape that was uh, an eighth of an inch and a quarter of an inch. And I couldn't find any anywhere until yesterday. Martha Stewart, 55% off. And um, I was so sad. They only had two left. It's always the way. But anyway, uh, for your cards and masking off for gold leafing and using paste of any kind, it's nice to not have really thick. Um, you know, so I've got the, like I said, eighth of an inch and a quarter of an inch. I got that. And then I really liked these letters for masking as well. I'm going to start using my sprays. I got the large alphabet set. It has 107 pieces. I like that font. And I got the smaller, thinner font, like uh, this one here. So that's an 84 piece. So I got those. And just trying to see here. I'm really organizing. probably put everything away. Isn't that crazy? I'm trying to think. Good night. There was... Oh, and I bought um, these gates. You can't have enough of these. I have a few projects, so I picked up that. And I'm just kind of... I started putting things... Uh, obviously, you have to start putting things away, so I'm not really sure. Um, what I got there... Uh, let me see. So maybe I know that's not it. I have. <laughs> Isn't that terrible? I know what I. Uh, let me just walk over here and see if there was anything else exciting. Um, oh, I got some more dots, enamel dots. Yeah, I know I got a few more things, and um, yeah, so. For now, that was it, and oh, I got some watercolor paper. Yes, I knew I got uh, I got three more large watercolor paper because they were on sale. They're put away already, and I got two My Mind's Eye paper packs that I put away. I knew I had gotten some paper, so um, I'm looking forward to you know get the Best Buy. I think I got was the um, Copic. 
compressor. I'm so excited about that. And I'm going to put, this is the last of things I have to put away. Oh, I bought some more. I know what I did get. Um, I bought some more glue. They're $4.99. So I bought two more because um, they had the 25% sale on. So that was nice. And so now I think I'm stocked up in glues. And thank you so much for joining me. I just wanted to uh, quickly show you a few things that I had gotten. I'm probably going to have a massive sale once I go through um, all my stuff because I have some some of those uh, turnabout things, you know, the white from Michaels with the uh, clip it all on top. I'm going to have two of them that are going to be free of stuff that I want to, um, you know, if anybody needs that. Uh, I just want to downsize everything because now that I have those units on the doors and um, I'm starting to put things in my apothecary, I'm starting to, it's freeing me up from stuff I had kind of on the floor that I don't want to use. So maybe I'll post some, um, you know, pictures and see if you need any of it. You can just email me and let me know. And I think that's about it, my friends. Just a small haul. And I'm super excited to use that machine. I think I'm going to go on and look and see what... Um, I'm not sure what these are. So I want to go on YouTube and check that out. And... Hmm. Isn't that funny? You come home with all these bags. <laughs> and it seems like so much... Oh, I got... Um, the Tim Holtz vellum. They had two packs at this Michaels and I love that vellum. Um, but you know, I got 25% off, but it was $24.99 for one pack. But you can't resist it because it's so stinking sweet. And uh, I have some projects I want to do with that. So I put that away. I'm just looking up over there just to see um, if there was anything else. But I guess that is about it. And Thank you so much for, like I said, for just always popping in and checking things out. And I had some scissors. It's really funny. Let me just say this really quick. I had these Martha Stewart scissors. They look like gold on the ends and they were titanium. They were absolutely beautiful, but in gold. They were $59.99. And when I got to the till, because I thought, okay, it's 30% off, then... 25%, you know, 55% off. I'll pay that for a good pair of scissors. Um, and I got up there, and it was the only thing that wasn't on sale. They didn't have her scissors on sale. Isn't that crazy? I said, are you kidding me? Like, I want these scissors. I love them. Well, $60 for a pair. You know, they were like this, like white ones like this, like her um, grass scissors or whatever. Uh, and they had a beautiful case over top of them and her scissors are you know they're really good I really like them but I was not going to pay that even at 25% I was not paying $40 for a pair of scissors no some things just you know you have to put the stopper on and that was one of them so anyway take care my friends if I don't see you I will um, you know see you on the next video and we'll talk to you then. Have a blessed week.